Come on, Barbie. Let's go party. SDC. Roblox. Roblox. Unbelievable Roblox. SDC hitting here. Um, ooh. Roblox. That is That stock has been incredible. That means incredible. Vips calls being sold. SDC, they're really getting after the nines, guys. SDC, they're really getting after the nines. GoPro lower. GoPro later. That trade is over. That trade's over. That trade is over. Dow, you're saying there's a chance. You're saying there's a chance. 70 or nothing, guys, on the ATR trade. Oh, EDU. Beast mode. I like that one. I like that one. QS, nice trading. Wait, I still have these calls I need to sell. Where's my O? What do I have? OCGN? Ooh, Holly Frontier. I just sold it a dime, guys. Ooh, Holly Frontier. I sold it 10 CMs. I just sold 20 Holly Frontiers from a nickel to 10. Now I got some at 20. I got some at 15. Holly Frontier, I just sold some 15 cents. What was that entry on Holly Frontier? Uh, I think it was like 40 cents. Oh, if they only had one more week left, Holly Frontier. What was our entry? Fisker. 18's trading, not taking these. Uh, Holly Frontier, the entry is 35. Um, Fisker. GT higher. I sold some at a dime. I bought some for a nickel. EDU coming back. Go, go, going lower. July calls and look at Weight Watchers, guys. The July calls are 50. They just traded up to 65, guys. So Weight Watchers traded up to 65 here, guys. So Weight Watchers did trade up to 65. Weight Watchers, it looks like they traded up to 65. EDU. AK buying the dip in EDU up $750. Uh huh, that's right. Those Oct 12 and a halfs are about to hit profit target one. So, Holly Frontier, if I can sell them at 15, I would call it an exit here at 15. We're going to go and pull the ripcord here in GT, I think. Let's pull the ripcord here in GT at 50, guys. So, GT, we're going to pull the ripcord here at 50. GT, we're going to pull the ripcord at 50. In GT. So GT, we're going to be out at 50 cents. GT, guys, we're going to pull the rip cord. That has gone from a loser to now a tie. So GT, we're going to pull the rip cord at 50 cents. So GT, we're going to pull out the rip cord at 50 cents. Go, go is over. And if Holly Frontier, I like to take those off at 15. So GT, we're going to pull the rip cord. I think there'll be better opportunities, guys. So we're gonna pull the rip cord here in GT. GT, we're pulling the rip cord here, guys. GT, we're gonna pull the rip cord. Ooh. So GT, we're gonna pull the rip cord at 50. So out of GT. 
Out of GT here. Holly Frontier 9, 515, CNX coming back. Dow up a buck. That was an ATR trade. Still trying to get 70 for those. EDU calls the bottom of that one pretty good. Oc 11s. Look at them go. Oc 12 and a half. Uh, Sohu will probably go to zero. That stock, that trade has sucked. Uh, the Chinese, a lot of the Chinese ones have been hard. Oh, look at GoGo -Go now, guys. Oh, AK, now you look much smarter. AK, you look smarter now. GoGo -Go doing down. Uh, July, as we pulled the ripcord at 105. Ooh, GoGo. -Go. So, GoGo, -Go, we pulled the ripcord on that one. Got up to 120. I actually do really do like um, a signal in... Um... GDRX Act Calls Google down 37. I actually like when the market goes down. I can put more money to work. So now it's a little bit slower. We'll just see some opportunities. So we look to see what hit the tape. Uber, someone said they went to 110. I don't care, I would not take these. Go, go, out of those. WETF, those are in the money calls and also June. Um, so I don't really care that much. Uh, Ford, I wouldn't take, and GM, I wouldn't take. I think the market closes on the lows. Ford, have you seen my Ford lately? 1587. Beast mode. Wow. That's all Holly Frontier for team. We go to Project 303 and see what those guys have been up to in here. We had a great trade in GoPro yesterday. I know a lot of people made a lot of money in GoPro. AFRM hoser puts. I don't care about puts, I only buy calls. Duke and IP. Duke 10 cents. IP 10 cents. <laughs> GoPro in and out of that trade yesterday. GoPro lower today. Good trading, AK. COG will go to zero. Bitcoin off the highs. Romaro, I have a buy right. So as long as RMO stays above nine, that's all I really care about. You can get into ears a little bit cheaper. So I'm down $200 in ears. Ears, I'm down 200 ZYNE up 150. Um, go, go, I'd be out of everything, guys. Go, go, no thank you. Weight Watcher is hitting 65, guys. So it looks like Profit Target 1 might have hit here. Weight Watchers. WW, July 16, 2021. Looks like you can probably get out at 65. We got you in at 45. 45 to 65, that's 40% profit. Yeah, we're not going to send out an exit until that's official. Um, they go 65 bid, but it does say the high of the day was 65. Weight Watchers still only traded 300,000 shares in a day. Uh, it says they traded 65, you look right here. It says they traded 65, I don't know. GT, we're out. Melka, over. Holly Frontier, 
GEVO trading here. So two trades, two winners. Uh, do I still, I still have QS on. I'm gonna take this off at 50. I was gonna buy like 500 of those at 20 cents. AK, why didn't you? All right, QS, I'm officially out here. So QS, I ended up making money. Officially. Go, go, and Weight Watchers, I did not take with my money. Any signal I give you, I can't take with my money. I can do whatever I want outside of that, though, which is always fun. Let's go to the cover calls. They've been getting beat up. So we've seen cover calls um, getting beat up a little bit lately, so let's go in here. Um, so yesterday we had, so where's NBRV, NBRV. 138, so those are unchanged. Express, uh, 520 and 30 cents. Let's update this. So Express, 520 and 20 cents. It was still up 70 cents, but took away a lot of that profit. So 15%. OEG down to 503, so we'll call it 505. And June 7 and a half in OEG. Those are 30 cents. So down a nickel. Slino, 127. So just lost another nickel. Steven. Romaro. BLDR trading here. Uh, Romaro weekly nines are basically they're like 980 and then 85, 80, we'll call it 87, just for argument's sake. So I'm up 40 cents on this one. That one's been a nice one. And then today, did two covered calls. 6-3. There you go, Weight Watchers. 600 bucks. Do I get a finder's fee for that? Did you hit 65? Did it hit 65 or no? Um, Slino, no, today's cover calls were ears. So I bought ears, I think at 440. Uh, ears, I bought at 438. It's worth four. And I sell June 18th, five calls. I sold these for 50. We'll update them tomorrow. We'll just update this one. And then the ZYNE stock. Ooh, here's another one. OGI, three and a halfs. Um, I'm looking at the open interest across the board, guys. OGI, three and a halfs. Oh, OGI. It's trade six million shares. July, three and a halfs in OGI trading here. OGI, three and a halfs trading here in July, 50 cents. Three and a half in July trading 50. OGI, three and a half trading 50. I think it's okay. OGI, three and a half trading 50. Ugh, this is a really small ATR. OGI would not be taken here, guys. OGI would not be taken. Uh, these are three and a half in July. OGI. Okay, ZYNE bought stock at uh, as a small ATR. As a small ATR. ZYNE 525. And I sold June 18th. Uh, seven and a half calls for 35, 30. Okay, so we'll keep a track of everything here. So these are covered calls. Uh, I'm gonna start doing these a lot more aggressively. Uh, Express, I have to manage tomorrow. So Express is down a lot today. That is okay. But up 92% since I launched this uh, about three weeks ago. It's pretty damn good.
wait watchers. I wait watchers. They brought a lot of American next week 27s. American next week 27s trade 25 cents. Small. Uh, Schlumberger, G. I like. I do like GD. Uh, Dvax. I still have a covered call on that one. So as long as it stays above eight, I just keep that money. Yeah, I sold. I, I did this one. Uh, I sold stock. Sold calls. Bought stock. This is when I was trading one lot. Now I'm trading like 10, 10 lots of covered calls. QS on fire. XPV. Where's that one? Ooh, that's working out. EDU, nice little pop from the lows. Uh, GD, I like GDRX. Long. Hmm. <laughs> what to do, what to do, what to do. GDRX. Good rich holdings. Nice. 500 bucks in XPEV. Uh-huh, that's right. Uh-huh, that's right. I like this one. Four, 400. QS, look at her go. The 31s, guys, back up to 63 cents. So if you didn't have that stop loss, I don't use stop loss. If you didn't have that stop loss, QS back up to 63 now. And the futures are bid. How do they know what to buy? It's unbelievable, AK. It's incredible. <laughs> For a while, I thought these people that are uh, on TV might have been taking my option actor. Ten minutes to go in the period. I still like comms. I still like end lock. Comms hasn't hit a target. Comcast. We got out of Comcast yesterday for a 50% stop. I should have taken Comcast. I know better. Should not have taken Comcast. Coca-Cola. Uh, calls being bought. Look at the futures. All the way back. XPV. These are up to 47, guys. That was an ATR trade. And at 29 cents, guys. So XPV and at 29 up to 47 now. XPV, guys. If you took it as a day trade, they both hit they hit both targets. So XPV, if you took those, that hit our day trade scanner. So on the day trade scanner, VIPS was a loser, QS was a winner, uh, XPV was a winner, and then after that. I don't take anything after the first 30 minutes. I wouldn't have taken any of these. But XPV winner, QS winner. UL puts trading, oh, UL calls trading here? What the heck is UL? I've never heard of that stuff. So. UL 62 and a half. Oh, Unilever. Dow getting close to the pin here. 70s for tomorrow. CVM trading here, nothing new in that one. Romaro. So if Romaro, as long as it stays above nine, I just keep that money. So I sold the nine calls, bought stock one to one. That will get me a, about a $500 winner in two days. 
as long as it stays above nine. So Romaro, RMO, the difference between 1050 and 905 is still the same to me. I sold puts naked basically, so I just keep that money. Let's go and see if there's any, oh, I did like Kroger calls from yesterday. July 44 is in Kroger I liked. 2931. NLK, OC trading. I can remove QS here. A, oh, AV, what are they saying? AVTR or something? Those are going to go to zero. Yeah, XPEV, I did swing trade those. So I have a target at uh, 70. They're up to 50. So I risk 50 bucks. I'm up 40. Weight Watchers. Man, it's not really making it. Or not really doing anything. And what I would do in Weight Watchers, I would keep a, a, an eye on the of this right here. So these are not on a 4560. So if these keep going down, if this bid starts decreasing, you might want to sell calls here. So keep an eye on that bid right here. Their bid for 120. If that 120 bid goes away, you might want to pull the ripcord and sell these for a small profit. EDU put EDU puts trade in here. BGS. They bought August 35s yesterday. This was an unbelievable signal from Option Hacker. Um these hit 60 cents yesterday. They trade up to 380, guys. More retail traders in the space. The better our option hacker is, the better the trades are going to be. I want more people trading. I I still have my GameStop hundred dollars between before uh, 350. I have about a thousand dollars with the with the dinners. I'm shocked to see the market pop. Futures are around 40 this morning. 40. AMC. AMC deserves to go down about $10. I mean, trust me, I like going to the movies. I think AMC is going back to 18. Let's see some uh, weekly. I would sell a weekly call spread. Can I sell the 50 51? It's 20 cents? Huh, that sucks. Trying to see how to short AMC. 72. The 47 straddles, $15. That's crazy. Mac. CNX coming back here a little bit. So there's July calls. These are July 14s or 1 to 105. Called a signal yesterday at 90. You know, we had a lot of action at the beginning of the day. And now it's just like, go, go. Good night. July's back down to 80. So I got you out of July's at, I got you out of July's at 105. Then they went to 120. So good news and the bad news. All McDonald's calls being bought, 235s. Small, McDonald's on three bucks. Mac D's. How are the futures only down 15 points? I thought today was gonna be a bloodbath. Usually what happened, we saw this before, when GameStop goes down, 
usually the market goes down with it because a lot of people have to sell other stocks if they're losing money in GameStop, but we see the market going straight higher. Three minutes to go, guys. Three minutes to go. Um, go, go, we're out. Weight Watchers still in. Weight Watchers did not hit a profit target officially. 45 in. They said they traded up to 65, but I didn't really see them trade up to 65. ETWO, July 15th is trading here, labeled as a spread. This was a huge winner we had in ETWO, um, July 12 and a half. Calm, I still like Calm. These are August upside calls. Uh, Com doesn't really have a big ATR. Actually, you know what I like, really like is PEI. PEI. Uh, PEI, they bought some July calls, those July 4s. If you can get those OC 4s for like 50 cents, I think those are okay. I've been looking at a little bit of stuff more longer dated. The front line stuff just moves so quickly. I love my Baroque music. We did not have any five minute bar longs today. No five minute bar longs. So that's a bull five minute bar with cloud. Futures down 13. Uh, QS, more QS trading here. So QS, we now see the 625 uh, 40s trading a buck. So QS guys, more calls being bought here. Uh, it's traded 8 million shares. So more QS trading here, 625.40s. Scan idea, buy QS, 625, not an official signal. 40 calls for a dollar. Targets, 115.2. So QS guys, uh, just an idea here in QS. QS, just an idea. Just an idea. Not an official signal. T-E-N, July 23s. You know what we saw? We saw Titan. That was an unbelievable signal. Titan. Machinery. Why are all the open interest going this one? Go, go. Nice pump and dump. That trade is over. I would not be buying anything go-go on a pullback, guys. I would not be buying anything go-go on a pullback. I said, no, thank you. I would not be buying anything go-go on a pullback at all. Got in, got out to 50%, move on to the next trade. I'm still just shocked to see. All right, that's it, guys. I have to go into Project 303. Everybody have a great weekend. Thanks, and I'll see you Monday morning. Remember, the trading room is not open on Fridays. Thanks, everyone.